buongiorno e buonasera a tutti, bentornati sul mio canale, io sono Asbrald, siamo qui, come vedete dal titolo, come vedete dalla schermata, con un nuovo gioco, è Ritorno al Futuro The Game. Mamma mia ragazzi, io sono appassionatissimo della saga di Ritorno al Futuro, li ho visti più o meno 40 volte, sì dai più o meno, dai una trentina di volte sicuramente. Questo è il gioco di Ritorno al Futuro eh, Allora, è in inglese, però vediamo di cavarcela, dai Dovremmo riuscire a fare qualcosa comunque L'inglese lo capisco abbastanza, quindi vediamo un po' Questi sono tutti i capitoli eh, Selezioniamo il primo episodio, It's About Time E vediamo che cosa, che cosa ci aspetta da questo gioco Vediamo eh, flusso canalizzatore Il Twin Pie Small Bellissimo New game Before we begin Would you like to see notification when Marty has a new goal? Uh, sì, dai, va bene Quando avrà un nuovo obiettivo, Marty Ecco, è un gioco della Telltale All right, I'm ready. Good evening i'm dr emmett brown Grand. i'm standing on the parking lot at twin pines mall it's saturday morning october 26 1985 1 18 a.m and this is temporal experiment number one come on i need hey boy get in there that a boy in you go get down get your seatbelt on that's it whoa 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 okay please note that einstein's clock is in precise synchronization with my control watch got it che spettacolo è proprio tutto come nel film Mitica DeLorean Se le mie calcolazioni sono corrette Quando questo bambino si alza 88 miles per ora Tu vedrai una cosa seria Ah vabbè in italiano era Ne vedremo delle belle Marti Però Guarda questo, guarda questo miglia all'ora You see, Einstein has just become the world's first time traveler. I sent him into the future. One minute into the future, to be exact. And at precisely 1.21 a.m. and zero seconds, we shall catch up with him and the time machine. Beh, lo conosco a memoria il film, quindi le battute. Wait a minute, Doc. Are you telling me that you built a time machine? Out of a DeLorean? The way I see it, if you're going to build a time machine into a car, why not do it with some style? Besides, the stainless steel construction made the flux espresso. Look out! Oh, oh. Uh, Doc? Oh, that's peculiar. Uh, where's the car, Doc? It should have caught up with us. 27 seconds ago. Doc, uh, what happened to Einstein? No need for concern. It's probably just a minor miscalibration of the time circuits. Marty, could you get my notebook? It should be in the toolbox. Ecco, questo nel film non c'era. <laughs> ok, quindi ci possiamo muovere. Obiettivo sbloccato, perfetto. Toolbox, ok. 
Tu sai col select ball, ok. Toolbox, ok. Nopo, nopo. Got it. Flux capacitor? That's it! What the heck's a flux capacitor? Oh yeah, this invention! The thing that makes time travel possible. Il flusso canalizzatore. I detail the nearly three decades of scientific breakthroughs necessary to build a working time machine. If it ever fell into the wrong hands, the consequences could be catastrophic. I see. Let's see. It's mass equals I times Z, and E equals the square root of Z times C squared, and the flux dispersal rate is inversely proportional to the fourth root of N. Um, Doc, shouldn't we get out of here before the Libyans show up? I'm sorry, Marty. Doc, come back! Doc! Grande Giove. Doc! Era solo un sogno? Marty, is everything okay? Yeah, Mom, I... It was, it was just a nightmare. Uh, Oppure no. It was no. in the past. Mm -hmm. Doc was there. Well, you're safe and sound now. Back in good old 1986. But you'd better get up. Your father's waiting for you. Huh? Aww. Aren't you going to meet him over at Doc's? <laughs> Holy crap, I'm late. Che spettacolo, ragazzi. Andiamo a vivere qualche parte del film, ma questo gioco tratta di argomenti nuovi. Ok, cominciamo proprio l'episodio 1. It's about time. Eh, le musiche di Alan Silvestri, ragazzi. Che spettacolo. Io ho tutta la collezione completa di tutte le tracce audio del primo, del secondo e del terzo. È eh, qualcosa di fantastico. Eh, tutti gli orologi <ride> Che bello ragazzi Beh, Ritorno al futuro è un capolavoro eh. Chi non l'avesse mai visto Se lo vada a vedere assolutamente Primo, secondo e terzo tutti insieme Sette ore di, eh, di saga Però ne vale troppo la pena 14 maggio 1986 Dad, are we too late to stop the sale? Better late than never. You wouldn't believe how much rare stuff there is back here. That's Doc stuff. The city has no right now, to... Now, son, I know you're upset, but your friend's been gone for months, and the city really seems hell-bent on using his land for that new parking garage, and... Hey, is that a first Heck. edition Jules Verne? <laughs> That's just not fair. But at least things can't get any worse. Hey Marty. <laughs> Beef. Hi Biff. <laughs> Come to see if the old crackpot had any buried treasure. Nah, I guess I'm just remembering. I miss Einstein. I see. A fish tank? I never knew Doc raised fish. Doc's fish had weird taste in decor. I kind of like Doc. Allora, cosa possiamo esplorare ancora? Does nature contrive it so that even with a time machine you can't intervene to prevent your own conception, for example? Does nature contrive it? 
Mi faccia uscire. Vabbè. <ride> Abbiamo sbagliato tasto, va bene. George! Allora, vediamo un po'. Town Square Model, bellissimo. Doc built this model at Downtown Hill Valley, way back in 1955. The clock tower in the courthouse even works. What the? Is that Doc's notebook in there? Eccolo. That looks just like the courthouse. You gotta hand it to the old coot. He was good with his hands. Uh, Biff, uh, can, can I see that a minute? This would look great in my fish tank. Give the old carp something new to nibble on. Ecco, sempre il solito idiota, Biff. <laughs> Uh, family Connection, Pick Inside Model. Mm. Ho visto io per primo. Eh, I guess you're right. But I picked it up first. Balordo, infame. Well, well, look at what we have here. Looks like plans for something. What's a flux catheter? It's none of your business. Doc asked me to. Round's worm food, kid. But this looks like it might be worth something. <laughs> Maledetto Biff, come sempre. Allora, vediamo. It would take a pretty powerful force to knock the notebook out of Biff's grasp. Eh. Quindi... Va bene. Ok, secondo me... Sì, beh, questo l'abbiamo capito. Dobbiamo praticamente prendergli sto libro perché sennò... Hey, let me try, Marty! Ora, ora, dai, pigliali. Let Marty have his turn. Uh, you got it, Mr. McFly. Che sottone che è diventato Biff, mamma mia. Hope that wasn't poison gas or anything. Feels like that was a lifetime ago. Eh, grazie. Actually, I guess it was. Vediamo se ci fa fare. Ah, no, è uguale. Enough of that Perfetto. junk. Now Biff. Sorry Marty. Ah, però è cambiata l'animazione, ok. Biff, hey, vediamo cosa gli dici. Allora. Glielo compriamo? I'll pay vediamo, dai. How much? Um... Not enough. Ah, <ride> disgraziato. I only want that notebook because, well, I'm, I'm sentimental. It's like a piece of Doc. Doc's dead. Time to get over it and move on. Ma che disgraziato. È, la, è pericoloso. It's dangerous. What is it set to explode or something? Sì, well, in faccia ti esplode. In a way. I'll take my chances. Ma che... It's just a notebook Vediamo. of Doc's scribblings. What did Doc ever accomplish? Nothing. And then it's worthless, right? If it was really worthless, you wouldn't want it so bad. Eh, lo so. That notebook Vabbè, non capiresti. You. you wouldn't even understand what's in it. You calling me ignorant? Sì, sì, sì. I'll pay you for it. How much? Uh, Not enough. Eh, vabbè. Just can't let you keep that notebook. It's dangerous. What is it set to explode or something? Se ti esplode un pugno in faccia però. I'll take my chances. Eh, abbiamo capito. I'll pay you for it. How much? Niente, uh, non ci fa enough. fare altro. Uh, never mind. Usciamo. Vediamo se possiamo fare altro. Doc must have whipped up some crazy compounds in that cauldron. <laughs> that smells like beef stew. <ride> Doc sure did love his Jules Verne. Eh beh, Giulio Verne, giustamente. Ok, vediamo se possiamo fare altro. Looks like a hand crank lightning rod, or maybe a lightning powered pencil sharpener. Ho visto una cosa. Ah, allora, chitarra. 
Dai, hey, Dad, spacchiamo. Why is my guitar got a price tag on it? Sorry, son. Must have been an overzealous clerk. Just pick it up. I'll iron things out with the bank. Ok. Uh, tu open your inventory. Ok. Perfetto. Usiamola. Giustamente. Eccolo qua. Come nel film. Dai, spacchiamo tutto. Here's an oldie. But a goodie. One, two, three. Hey, look! It's Chuck Butthead! <ride> Vai! Show you how it's done. Ecco, lo stupido Now lo fa lui. If, I think that's Marty's guitar. Oh, gosh. Uh, you're right, Mr. McFly. Oh, here you go, Marty. Let's hear a few licks. Grande. Wow, that was sizzling hot. Like a melting ice cube. <ride> Va bene. Ma giustamente lui aveva portato via. Vabbè. Uh... About Biff. Dad. Eh, ho sbagliato. I know you're trying to help. He talks a big game, son, but he's not so tough. I've been dealing with him a long time. Believe me, I can handle him. So can I. Mm, I guess you can. can. Okay, son. I'll stay out of your way. You know where to find me. Do you think dreams can predict the future? Well, you know I don't go in for that mystical stuff. But I do think they can reflect how you're feeling about the future. <laughs> I'm telling you, this sale is a joke. Doc's only been gone for a few months and I happen to know... Yes, you've told us he's not dead. He's on a trip. Let's say you're right. Have you considered that this trip may not have been entirely voluntary? I eh, hate vabbè. to say it, but Doc's run up some pretty sizable debts around town. Maybe he's just hiding from his creditors. Ah, George, ma che stai? Who's running the sale anyway? Oh, that'd be me, son. You? Why? Well, once it became apparent that the bank was going through with the sale, I volunteered to oversee it in order to make sure that Doc's stuff would be treated with a modicum of respect. Isn't that right, Biff? You got it, Mr. McFly! <laughs> Va bene. That notebook is Doc's legacy. I've got an obligation to protect it. Now, hold on a minute. Didn't you just get done telling me Doc's still around? Off traveling somewhere? Yeah. Then how is it your obligation to protect his legacy? You can't have it both ways, Marty. If Doc's alive, he can protect his own legacy. Ma come? Problem? Biff? He's got this thing, see, and I really need to get it back. If he stole something from you... No, it, it's one of Doc's notebooks. Yeah, he found it first, but... Oh. Well, then I'm not sure what to tell you. I guess you'll just have to appeal to his better angels or something. Or something. You got Doc wrong. Sure, maybe he's not so good with money. That's just because his mind's always on bigger things. But he's still a straight-up guy. He'd never run away from his problems. Well, you know him better than I do, son. But the bank is within its rights to sell off his stuff. Maybe you should try to find some things to remember him by before Biff grabs them all. Vabbè. Diciamo che Thanks dad. Non risolviamo niente in questo modo, ok. Quality's good, but it needs more bass and treble and a volume. Eh è quello che ti stavo dicendo di fare. And now something your kids are really gonna like. Thanks for warming them up for me, butthead. When it's one for the monkey, two for the snow, three to get ready, now go, Scat, go! Woo! <laughs> Scemo. Ah, dobbiamo riuscire. Let's make some noise. Oh, questo volevo io. Vai, vai, che facciamo esplodere tutto. E ci prendiamo il libro. 
You want to hear a number Back by Biff and the Biff Tones? Always happy to play for my adoring fans. Bye. Now watch me blow the lid off this joint. Whatever you say. <laughs> <laughs> Rock on, Biff. Oh, Grandissimo yeah. Biff. <laughs> Idiota. Oh, finalmente. Ah, Doc, where are you? Eccolo. Che corsa elegante, Marty. La DeLorean ghiacciata. Cos'è, scotta? No, no, è fredda, ghiacciata. <ride> Dog's Legacy. <coughs> Grande. Where do you come from, boy? Didn't you bring Doc with you? Eh no, mi sa proprio di no. Circuiti temporali. Flusso canalizzatore. Automatic retrieval? In case of my failure yeah, to return to the DeLorean within an allotted time, I program the time machine to jump to these four dimensional coordinates without me. As you are well aware, time travel is an inherently risky activity, and despite my elaborate precautions, there's always the possibility that I could land in trouble sometime. And that sometime is now, or then, or uh, maybe later. He's in trouble. <laughs> Marty, you come to my rescue in the past, or was it the future? Anyway. I'm relying on you to do it again. Please take the DeLorean back or, or forward to whatever it is I'm stuck in time. When you get there, I'm sure you'll figure out what to do. That's it? Aren't you going to tell me when that is? Just go to the date specified on the time circuit readout under the heading mark Last Time Departed. Good luck. Eh, right, fine. right, Last Time Departed. Last Dovresti time departed. Uh, oh, jeez. Come on, come on. Come sempre. Crap! Oh, great. How am I supposed to find him now? Okay, Doc, I know I haven't seen Vediamo. you in a few months, but I'm pretty sure this isn't your shoe. <laughs> Beh. Come minimo. Looks like the time circuits still work. Now I only need to know when to look for Doc. I can use those to enter a date into the time circuits. But once okay, I know when to look perfetto. for Doc... Probably shouldn't fill with the time circuits again until I know when to look for Doc. I can use those to enter a date into the time circuits. Eh, ho capito, ma once I know when to look for Doc. Ah, dobbiamo uscire. Usciamo. Ok, full. Ok, perfetto. Allora Vediamo un po' che cosa possiamo fare. Se Einstein ci può dare una mano. Ecco, lui ce l'ha detto, però ovviamente noi non l'abbiamo capito. Vediamo cosa possiamo fare. Eh, comunque secondo me è dentro l'auto, perché se no non abbiamo altro... Non abbiamo altra scelta. Probably shouldn't fill with the time circuits again until I know when to look for Doc. Uh, allora, vediamo un po'. Uh, there's something smells fishy here. Maybe Einstein can mix something of this clue. Ah, ok, ok, ho capito, ho capito. 
mi sembra di aver capito Eccola qua Dobbiamo darla ad Einstein eh, Ecco Great Scott I think he's onto something. <ride> grande Giove, grande. Lo skateboard classico. Ok, now we're getting somewhere. How's this supposed to lead me to Doc, Ainy? Strickland Grande Step away from the door ah. <laughs> Now Let me get a look at you Einstein come on Just as I suspected Hooligans Get along now <laughs> Scat I'm not a hooligan ma'am I'm a, a teenager I wasn't born yesterday young man Aren't you the miscreant who skateboards through the town square every morning between 8 and 8.30 in a decidedly unpunctual manner? Uh, yeah. <laughs> All skateboarders are hooligans. It's a fact. Ah, beh, giustamente. È come darle torto, no? Giustamente. Stay your business, child. You're making me miss Merv. Well, see, that's the thing. I'm not sure why I'm here. Einstein here brought me and Well Can you let me in? I've got something to show you. What is it? Let me see. A shoe? Now, now what would I want with a eh. Stay there. Sei ricordata, eh, la vecchia. <ride> che faccia? Ah, giustamente. Ma povero cane. Piccolo E andiamo da sta vecchia pazza Wow Che casa Bella There's a lot of stairs To return the shoe I mean I lost it ages ago You can put it down next to the other one Much better. So neat and orderly. Yeah, I suppose you'll be wanting some sort of reward now. No, I... All I've certo. got is tea and candy. But... I'm sorry I called you <laughs> a hooligan. I try not to jump to conclusions, but after all, nine out of ten people in this city are hooligans. It's a fact. Sì, sì, Look it up. Da una che si chiama Strick non ha acceso neanche <ride> Non ha acceso neanche il fornello. Quanto è simpatica questa vecchietta. <ride> Questo fa il guardiano del faro. Va bene, dai, allora diciamo che possiamo concludere con questo primo episodio di Ritorno al futuro The Game. Bellissimo, adesso ovviamente abbiamo questa vecchia pazza che fa il controllo di tutto il quartiere vediamo cosa riusciamo a scoprire riguardo a Doc io, io vi rimando al prossimo episodio iscrivetevi al canale se non avete ancora fatto lasciate un like, lasciate un commento e condividete il video ci vediamo al prossimo video un saluto a tutti da Asprat